early. They, they're going to try and be patient. Uh, I don't know that they'll fast break a lot, but I think that if the break is there, they'll take it. If not, we're going to see a half court game. Tip one by Washington. We open up with the gold. Trimmed in purple and white. Here is Overton getting his second start of the year. Coming off the screen inside the three point arc, and he nails a long jump shot. 2 0 Washington. Now they come to trap Matthew Bryan Amonick. He'll hook pass cross court to Holiday. Now Overton. Three players swarming. Skip pass to Thomas. Three players trap him. Cross court it comes to Matthew Bryan Amonick. Skip pass 13 to shoot to Overton. Into the lane to Thomas. Straight away three. God, and boy, that'll take the heart out of you after all that effort on the defensive end. But what's happening right now is that they added a little wrinkle there where you got three guys almost trapping one. So they forced the Huskies to get into a hurry, and then they got to take a tough shot. But a great pass by Benoit Overton to save. And Oregon State in the 1-3-1 zone with Amari Johnson up top at the point. Thomas for three. Recovered by Benoit Overton and a lay it in. Beautiful play. Well, great play. Terrence Ross is on the floor along with Darnell Kant and Matthew Bryan Amity. This is Thomas into the lane to the glass. That was way too easy. And, and, and that's the chink in the 1 3 1. Taken off the floor by Terrence Ross. Coming off a career high, 25 points. Laser pass. Thomas, Matthew Bryan Amity, and the payoff. A big punch at the rim. I tell you, that, that, that's where he has improved so much. I mean, the man, because, you know, he really went at it. They thought he was going to get it. But here you see that the Huskies get out on the break. And look at the laser pass <laughs> right on the dime. Washington Holiday drops it low to his ease end job. Turns, backs, bumps, missed it. Rebound tipped up and in. Well done, Justin Holiday. Yeah, that. Overton. Nice movement without the ball, setting up Wilcox for three. Nope, and there's Holiday again with an offensive rebound and the putback for a bucket. By the crowd, when he missed it. 23-18. Five-point lead for Oregon State. Washington gets busy with Matthew Bryan Hamming, augering himself into the lane and throwing up that little half hook off the window. And they're hanging in this game, and that's not something the Huskies want to let happen. Six-point Oregon State lead, but Isaiah Thomas cuts into it quickly with a well-aimed three-pointer. He seems to anticipate well right there, the penetration, and he catches it right at the top. Oregon State, Beavers playing well with 448 left in the first half. Thomas for three. Got another one. Isaiah Thomas coming off a cracker jack evening. Ready this year, Oregon State's registered a big win against Arizona. That was last week in the opening weekend of Pac-10 play. Matthew Brian and he found the driving into the lane. Starks got a piece. Ball loose. Matthew Brian Amity. Thomas open three. How'd he miss? Put up and in by Matthew Brian Amity. Outstanding reaction and the foul. <laughs> back in the 2-3 zone. I see them kind of stretching it out, trying to cover everybody. Wide open look. Hey, three points. That's what we want. Sucks a three. Washington had not led since 2-0, but they take. He's playing within himself. The ball gets swung around. He lines it up, nails it, nothing but the net. Suggs was 3-5 of five against the Ducks from three-point range. 21 seconds left in the half, and now the Beavers behind with possession. Cunningham to Roberto Nelson. One or the other will have to get off a shot. It's Nelson, the running right-hander, an acrobatic play by Roberto. Here comes Washington. Benoit Overton got a great look at the buzzer. Around and in looks like it'll count at the buzzer. Well, and the Huskies take the lead 40-39. Right now, the Huskies got to be patient, and they got to try and put this team away. Isaiah Thomas, outstanding in the first half, 16 points. 14 points, actually, in 16 minutes. And here's a shot thrown up there with some touch. Matthew Bryan amening. Cross-court pass intercepted. Benoit read that one all the way to the glass. Lane. And great start for Washington. Got a couple of buckets here. Cunningham nearly slipped. Angus Brandt into the lane. Rejected by Aziz Enjai. But 
Well found by Haynes. His shot off the mark. Holiday with the rebound. Uh, great defensive play by Enzai. I mean, he changed everybody's thinking on that. And he makes a real good move. He catches, he showed good hands yeah. that time when he caught the ball and was able to make it uh, to the basket. You take a look at him down here. Watch, he comes over. And I'll tell you, he's there. Both of them get the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Brian or Manning, he got a good hand on that. And, and then and drop back in the zone. They played the 1-3-1. One, one. They'll play the 2-3. They'll pressure. The times full court, nice pass, finding the back of the zone over to the Holiday, running along the baseline for the two-hand jam. Right there, they read the situation all the way. Vinoy has his eye on his teammate. The cross court hit a leg of a Beaver, picked up by Thomas. How did he find Matthew Bryan Ammoning through that labyrinth of arms and legs? He threw a bullet in there again. Another pass by Thomas to this target, Matthew Bryan Ammoning. Yeah, well, I see he's dribbling with his head up. Look, he's got his head up right away. He sees the floor. He makes a great pass to Brian Ammoning, and all of a sudden, we're off to the races again. Maintain some sort of contact with Washington. It'll be tough to do turning the ball over like that. Matthew Bryan Ammoning has a step on the defense to the glass. Lay it in. Man, was that impressive as he went sprinting down the floor. Well, you got to give the big guy kudos on that one, Devin. Uh, he anticipated the play. He stepped in, got the ball, took it all the way to the basket. Uh, I tell you, Brian uh, Manning is really having some kind of game. Take a look at this right there. I mean, he's got control all the way to the hoop, even with a guy running in front of him. That's a great play. I tell you. Intensity that Oregon State's not been able to reply to. Thomas, triple team, Matthew Bryan Amity, one dribble adjustment to the glass, bounces it up and in. Well, you can't stop him now. Eight, Matthew Bryan Amity. He has scored the last six points for Washington. They're giving up to Suggs for an open look at three in transition. That was beautiful. Well, you got to Thomas. Guys, they can elevate. You know, missed a shot, but a head guy there to grab him. Blaine Robinson and... and Created a relationship with the coach. He decided he would go to Oregon State. Here comes Terrence Ross. Ross scores. The floor. Look at him. Offensive rebound. Kick out. Thomas for three. Ross the five. Tapped it up and in. The Huskies just come at you in waves. Bounces inside to Gant. Wriggles into the air. Had it blocked. Got it back. That's Ross. Missing. Tapped up and in. By Matthew Bryan Amity. 20 points now. 10 boards for. To open the gap with a lead by 14 right now. And uh, folks, Angie Mentink reminding you, remember this day. No one had ever hosted a playoff game with a 79 record and no one thought this would happen. Marshawn Lynch busting through the line. This epitomizes what happened at Quest Field today and everybody is coming with him. Look at him, that's Matt Hasselbeck down there, down on the field blocking. The whole offensive line was there and the Hawks have done it. They beat the Saints 41 to 36, the final. Congratulations. Holiday to Suggs, catch and shoot three up and in, and he has quietly put together another nice game. Nine points for Steve. Nice pass over to the inside to Anjai, and a little anatomy, drop step by Nelson, and slams to the exchange of big for a point, another point guard. Uh, great pass by Vanoy. Out of college basketball. Thomas into the lane to Aziz Enjai. Backed it up and in. And the freshman, seven feet, two by one win in conference. Seven and 11 the first year. Here's Thomas into the lane. Rebound inside Darnell Gann. Just Thomas working in the paint. Well, the game limiting him to four minutes. He saw some time in the first half. Now he's back in. Thomas for three. Isaiah, he has been sharp again. Their defense was just stifling. Overton up the floor. Thomas shares it. Matthew Bryan handling the score. That's what great ball movement does. Not good ball movement, but great ball movement. And look at the block by Brian O'Manning. I mean, that's incredible. He gets back on D, makes that kind of block, and then they go down the other end and get away. 
He's loving it. <laughs> and then the block on Joe Burton for a recovery, and that deserves a standing ovation. And they will get it from the Husky faithful. Cunningham in the lane. Spike by Gant. Tipped off of Oregon State, out of bounds. Washington's defense now is just becoming a bulldozer. 450 left in the ball game, and Craig Robinson needs a timeout. Ten blocks for Washington. A 20-point dog lead. We take a look at this. Uh, give kudos to uh, Matthew and Matt, uh, Brian and Manny. Look at this. He comes all the way back. Well, that's Gant getting. Matthew got the first one. Yeah. Gant gets the second one. Travel. CJ Wilcox with a test. Nope. Rebound. Terrence Ross right back up and in. Rides and scoops. The Englishman into the air. Had a block. Got it back. Laid it in. Everything easy for him right now. Under the court, it means the party is over. Suggs hits the three-point shot. The, end, and the other team was trying to make something desperate happen. And, and then, of course, you have to stay patient. And right there, Ross, he's been going three happy. They're, they're just looking for too many outside shots. That's not going to get you back in the game. Ross running the baseline, ripped away from behind. Big time defensive effort by Washington in the second half. They led halfway through 40 39. Ross for three. God, man, that's the kind of fluid, silky shot we saw Thursday here against the Ducks. Yeah, these guys, because he's the one guy that if you leave him wide open, you know he's going to knock down the two points. Huskies up 30 with a minute 26 left. Brand has it picked from behind by Wilcox. CJ to the glass. And the Huskies are at the century mark. Oregon State, meantime, can hold the distinction of being the first Pac-10 team this year to score 70 against Washington. However, they're getting beat by 32 as Ross centers a three right on. 14 points, seven boards for Terrence Ross.